Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the Page of Cups, Water Energy, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio Energy, and this is an energy here of somebody really being interested in you. I am seeing someone who is infatuated by you, someone who is drawn towards you. They see your beauty and they are highly attracted to you. And this person, they may even idealize you a bit. This person is showing up as a, a majorly, very much a romantic. This is someone who um, believes in love and they love love. And um, I do see them expressing their feelings to you, wearing their heart on their sleeve and just daydreaming. This is someone who has these fantasies about having something with you. They have a major crush on you and they see your beauty from inside and out. And um, I'm seeing them really um, coming towards you with this energy. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Scorpio. Okay, so the first card we have here is the pa the Knight of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. Next, we have the Ace of Swords, Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. And finally, we have the King of Wands, Fire Energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo Energy. Okay, so I am seeing someone who is coming towards you um, very passionately and very eager. Um, this person is coming towards you with a very solid offer with this Knight of Pentacles. This is something that this person has really thought out with an Ace of um, Swords. They have taken time to think about this. Um, it may have started out as a crush, but I'm seeing it developing into something a lot more mature, something more solid. And this person is wanting something stable with you and they are pursuing you with this King of Wands energy. So this person, I'm seeing, um, you know, a charming energy on them. Um, this is somebody who... Um, who is confident and they are confidently coming towards you with an offer of commitment with that knight of pentacles they want something stable something that can really go the long term and um they are making their intentions known to you this person i am seeing them um you know this is somebody who is admired by many people so they are quite charming and attractive and um definitely they want to start something with you with this ace of swords they want a victory with you and um they are making it known i'm seeing some sort of communication a conversation where they are honest and letting their thoughts be known so let's clarify these cards scorpio Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Wands. So again, we are seeing um, a desire to start something with you. This person is very passionate about you, very attracted to you, and they feel a spark. Um, this person is attracted to you on many levels. It's more than just physical um, attraction. With the Ace of Swords, I do see a mental attraction as well. So this person likes everything about you. Um, they see you as, you know, a whole package, and um, I do see them coming towards you. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Scorpio. Okay, so the first card we have here is the Seven of Cups. And this is Water Energy, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio Energy. Next we have the Knight of Wands, Fire Energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo Energy. And finally we have the Nine of Pentacles, Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. And I am seeing with this Nine of Pentacles, this is definitely a good omen 
for the stuff this person is very attracted to you um they have a lot of hope in a future with you um this person they they really do desire you uh they, they are very passionate i'm seeing them um moving towards you quite quickly with that knight of knight of wands they are feeling the spark and um they they feel a need to initiate things with you so they are definitely ready to get this started um this person has daydream fantasized a lot about this with the seven of um, cups and the page of cups so this is something that they've been thinking about a long time and they are finally ready to take action towards their desire okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you scorpio So at the bottom of the deck we have you are good enough full moon in virgo so this person sees your value they think very highly of you they respect you and um with this nine of pentacles energy again i'm seeing them really valuing you for who you are as a person um their their interest in you goes much deeper than just physical attraction okay so i'm going to pull out another card for you scorpio So the card says, unanimity and harmony. He who lives in harmony with himself lives in harmony with the universe. Okay, so this person is wanting um, something quite real with you, something harmonious with you, something quite um, stable as well. They see you as somebody who has it all together, somebody who is living a very um, harmonious life and um, they really admire this about you so I am seeing this person quite inspired by you and also having a desire to be with you okay so that's what I'm seeing for you Scorpio I hope you have a really really good day Scorpio bye Scorpio